Hi everybody, it's your girl Tofu. We are back today with some Walking Dead. And can we just take a moment to look at like, not the thumbnails, but like, what's to come? Because this one especially, ooh, that looks good. So I think we have a lot to look forward to, but in the meantime, let's continue with what we're doing, which is starting episode two. <coughs> Sorry, I'm like really snotty today. I can like feel it in like my nose and like the back of my throat and I'm just like ah! like trying to get it like dislodged and I think my voice sounds a little bit worse today. It's a little bit harder to talk because of like all the phlegm, you know, nasty shit, isn't it? But I'm feeling a lot better, which is the most important, you know, you feel. I just sound horrible. <laughs> <coughs> This looks familiar. Well, they shouldn't be able to get through that. On the Wait, it doesn't. Can't get through them. Okay, it just skipped a little. I was so confused. I was like, did I start the wrong episode? Hold on, I think I need to change the volume for you guys. This game is so fucking quiet. Alright, this should be good. Now it's probably too loud, but I don't care. I think I fixed it. I don't know. This game is just so fucking quiet. How are you feeling? Well, other than this bite, I'm just peachy. Hand me that third. Are you kidding me? Cutting it off won't work. Says who? <coughs> I knew someone who tried it. Just because it didn't work once don't mean it can't work at all. I don't want to watch this, dude. I can't watch it. No, I can't do it. Okay, okay. Stuck big. What are you gonna do? Carry me out of here on your back? Hell. Just, just give me a minute. Try to get some rest. There's a lot of stuff in here. I'll try to find something to help. There would be anything in there. <coughs> anything in that? Sorry, it's oh, empty. Damn it. <coughs> I'll keep looking around. Figured there would be nothing useful in there. All right. Use? Use it on what? Are you sure you don't want to? I mean, maybe I could... That's a no, ain't it? What's in there? Anything oh my god, stop use? asking that. I'll tell you if we can use something. Give me one of those. Probably tastes like pine tar by now. But I'd smoke a dead coon's tail if you had one. I don't want Clementine to know how to smoke. It's bad for your lungs. And Clementine needs her lungs to outrun the zombies. She don't need black lung. She won't be able to run away from the zombies if she got black lungs. So no, we're not gonna ask him to teach us how to smoke. Jesus! Do they ever taste good? We wait. For 
what? Did I trigger something? Maybe I didn't look hard enough. Sir, I didn't get to explore back there. Was that it? I didn't mean to trigger the story. Well, guess I did. She gonna get stuck with a zombie again. His eyes are gonna be yellow. Grab the saw. Girl, grab the saw right now while you have the chance. We're gonna have to use it on him. I don't wanna examine him, I wanna grab the saw! You know what? Clementine's just hell bent on dying, so. Eat? <sighs> Jesus fucking Christ. He looks fine right now. I mean, not for much longer. He he about to die, but I feel like ten pounds of shit in a five pound sack. <coughs> this is so sad because she went through this with Lee. <laughs> She's having to do it again. Oh god, it's fucking painful. <coughs> Jeez. Stuck in this can the whole day. Ugh. You wanna hear something funny? No, nah, sure. I've been thinking. I don't want to die. <laughs> oh, I never thought I'd be the kind of idiot to say something like that. But <coughs> there it is. I'm scared, Clementine. Jesus, I'm scared. Well, you're going to be okay. Oh, at least spare me the bedside bullshit. Sorry. Would you, would you promise me you'll watch out for Nick? Nick is like twice our age. Why do I have to watch out for Nick? I was about to say, Nick can clearly take care of himself. That's not fucking true, but like, it's not my fucking job to take care of Nick when I am the small child here. Whatever. Fine. Sure, we'll take care of Nick. I love that stupid kid. No matter what you think, he is a good boy. He's literally older. He's Whatever. Fine. Him, Fuck he it. He is a good boy. Do what I can. Thank you. Been almost a day. I'm sorry, I'm pausing a lot, but how can Pete like remember that if Pete's gonna fucking die? Whatever. Okay, I'll stop pausing, sorry. <coughs> Where are you going? You gonna open that up? gonna have to make a break for it. Let's take the saw before we do. I'll buy you some time. You're coming with me. To do what? Die a couple hours later than now? I'm sorry, I need water. <laughs> that doesn't fucking work, does it? God damn it! Okay, okay. Can you breathe now? Better. Okay. Say goodbye to Nick. All right. I'll try. Well, like my dad <coughs> used to say, we're burning daylight. Let's get this over with. I think he's still going to end up sacrificing himself for us. I feel like every single decision I make is kind of pointless. The phlegm. <laughs> the phlegm is bad today, my people. Eh? Honestly, if I took better care of myself, this wouldn't happen, but I kind of deserve this. 
I haven't been getting a lot of sleep lately. I have not been eating my veggies. And I have not been hydrating enough, so I deserve this pain. <laughs> it doesn't make me feel better about it though. Let's fucking continue. If we're gonna encounter another doggo, I'm done. Where are they? Clem! We got attacked. By who? Walkers. Jesus! We all got split up. I was with Pete, but... My God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there! Get the guns! Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. Damn it, Luke. <coughs> Clementine, can you, can you please watch Sarah? She's upstairs. Just distract her and don't tell her anything. She gets nervous. Just go. Hurry. I want to know more about Sarah. We'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. I don't want to judge it. But y'all know I'm judging it anyway. What What is the deal with Sarah? What is happening there? Say cheese. I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. Shh. It's so Shh. cool. Take one of me. Come on, take one of me. Sure. Get me in a good pose, okay? Okay, I'm ready. It's kind of a good photo. What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? Clem, you're scaring me. I want to know what happens you if you do that. know what's going on. I want to know. He told you not to tell me, didn't he? He is in trouble. Oh my gosh. What happened? Clem? What's going on? Drama! Pete's dead. Sorry, I, I, I just need to... I feel like... Sarah won't survive long in this universe. You want to see what I found? Damn, you recover quick. Will you show me how to use it? I couldn't find any bullets. Oh no. If something's wrong, I should know. What if I have to use one? I don't think there's a way we can okay, win with this. But it's not a toy. I know. First, remember, it's just a thing. What does that mean? You're gonna um, hit yourself in the eyeball. I don't know. I thought it'd be heavier. Okay. What do I do? The most important thing is, when you go to shoot, take a breath before you pull the trigger. I miss Lee! <laughs> Not that big. <sighs> what should I shoot? Don't do that! S -s -s sorry Sorry! Maybe I could practice outside. Mm. There's that tree. Mm. Hey, Luke's back. What should you do? Okay. Oh, I was wondering if I could even go that way. Is that not Luke? I think it could be an imposter. All right, over here we go. Hmm. 
That's not Luke. Clem, I think I know him. Who is it? No, stay there. Don't move. He can't see Don't me. fucking move. You have to make him go away. What? Why can't he see you? I should have probably told her to go hide, but... No. Clem, I can't breathe. I can't, I can't breathe. Shh. So she has panic attacks. That's cool. Same girl, Hello. same. Hello there. Get out of here now. Is that how your dad taught you to greet a neighbor? Yes. I've got a gun. A smart girl. I would too. But I'm not a bad guy, honey. Promise you that. My family and I are set up a ways down river on. Kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? I'm Carly. Carly. That's a sweet name. You mind if I come in? Carly? I've been out all morning and this heat has got me cooked. Yes, I do mind. It's a nice place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. Sure could pack a lot of folks in there. We have a big group. Lots. Oh? How big? Dozens. They'll be back soon. And they left you here all alone. They must trust you. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and... I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and an old man. A Spanish guy and his daughter. A quiet girl. A bit taller than you. A big black guy. This big. And a pretty little pregnant lady. I saw them. They're dead. You saw who? Where? Down by the river the other day. Walkers got them. I'm sorry. <laughs> The river? You sure about that? Pretty sure. Well, no offense, but I guess that wasn't them. Because the ones I'm looking for are very careful people. If you say so. Well, looks like a damn tornado ran through here. Must be like close to ten people with you. More. Hmm. Just passing through or you've been here a while? You listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. And I'm not sure why you'd go anywhere after finding this place. Hell, I just got here and I already don't want to leave. Just passing through. Going north. Whole lot of people headed that way lately. Me, I don't get it. There's just as much nothing up there as there is down here. And I can't stand that Yankee weather. The cold slows them down. Well, that's not worth the trade, in my opinion. He's gonna shoot us if we find the knife. Oh, fuck. Where does this go? Uh, in the drawer there. I don't know how to approach this situation, honestly. Well, it's a real nice place. Kind of cozy. <laughs> I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Doctor. Real smug son of a bitch. But a smart man. I miss him. What happened to him? I'll just say we had our differences. Oh, no. Sooner or later, People close to you will find a reason to cross you. Happens every time. <coughs> well, well. White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. What was Crap. that?
I thought you said nobody's here. Nobody is here. I don't think I approach this situation the greatest. You. Nobody's here. Seems that way. Didn't mean to be rude. Couldn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Sure. I think I've troubled you long enough. I can let myself out. Why shouldn't I trust them? You have a real good day now. Wait. Oh, that wasn't a great decision, was it? Don't come out yet, girl. Stay back there. Where is he? He's gone. So you think. What if he comes back? Okay, so what happened? We need to find the others. We can't go outside. Why not? Clementine. Sarah. Well, they told me about Pete. You know where he is, right? Come on, let's go. A man was here. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Rebecca. Calm down? I am calm. You calm down. We don't know anything yet. I didn't open the door. He just came in. She's telling the truth. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name oh, was? God. Maybe it wasn't him. You know damn well who it was. Did he say his name? I didn't ask his name. Crap, crap, you didn't crap, ask crap, his crap, name? Crap, crap, crap. How could you not ask his name? He had a gun. I didn't want to make him mad. Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? How old I don't know! He? he had a mustache. Like mine, or more like Alvin's? Um, it was droopy. He talked about you, Dad. I don't remember anything about that guy. Fuck! Of course he won't, Sarah. Now, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not gonna do anything crazy. Or not nice. Right? You know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. All right, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? He saw a picture of me. A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. You told me to distract her. Distract? Oh, fuck. Sarah. Fuck! An idiot? I thought we were friends. Fuck! <laughs> He was scouting. Not making great decisions. Unlucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. She hadn't been there. Well, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Everyone pack up. We're moving now. Alvin, wait! We have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. Why did you leave his camp? Because we had to. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We would 
lucky to escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. We have to leave. We have to find Pete. We'll get him on the way out, Nick. Clementine, you know where he was, right? Yeah. All right. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. Oh my god. Oh, I don't think I made any great decisions there, honestly. You said it was just up here? Yeah, just a little ways. Hey, Clem. Sorry if I gave you some shit back there. I'm just a little on edge. <sighs> it's just a tough time right now with the pregnancy and all. You and Alvin can probably relate. Why is Carver after you? After me? Oh, you mean us. It's a long story. Do you think that's Carver's child? Because, mm, mm, remember how she's like, please let it be his, please let it be his. I'm wondering. He, he has a hard time letting go. I know you did your best back there. You know, none of us would make it on our own. Sometimes it's hard knowing just how dependent I am on everyone. I'm not used to that. I'm not comfortable with that. I'm supposed to be a mom soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. Alvin and I still don't know what to call her. Or him if that man gets his wish. God help me. Any ideas? Clem? Look at the blood! Looks pretty fresh. Are we gonna see him, but he's a zombie? Is he gonna pop out? There. That's where we were. <coughs> he's not in here. This was the last place I saw him. Maybe he's around here somewhere. your eyes open and stay in sight. Pretty sure he's dead. Like, fairly certain. I mean, barely alive. Almost dead, if not dead. Maybe someone just put him out of his misery. We need to go. He's gone. Nick, he, he's gone. We gotta get moving. Come on, man. That's so sad. I liked him. Tell me. Tell me how it happened. Loki! Come on, come on. Right here. He saved my life. Well, that was. that was Pete. <coughs> <I'm for me, would you? You sure you still want to come with us? <sighs> Is he really like our age? Because I swear to God, he's like two times as old as us. Like, this is it, Nick. Why do I need to keep my eye on him? I can't keep looking out for Sarah and Nick. What about me? I am a small child. Jesus fucking Christ. Look, I know we got off to a rough start. I can't make any promises it won't get rougher, but we all know you now. 
We may not be perfect, but we look out for each other. Yeah, I'm with you guys. And we are glad to have you. Not everyone is. Well, they'll get there. I figure we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, if they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. Five days? Sounds too easy. It's gonna be okay, Ben. We have to keep moving now. It's our only choice. Nick sure is walking slow. It's a pretty large jump of time. Look, he's still walking like that five days later. Be that ski resort. I've never been skiing. Beck and I went once. It wasn't pretty. Here, eat this back. But we're almost out of food. We gotta save it. There's a building on the mountain. What's it look like? It's big. That sounds like a good place to spend the it's night. It's a very obvious place to spend the night. There's the bridge. And does it look passable? I think so. Good. There's a little house by the bridge. How big is it? It's pretty small. We have to cross that bridge. Let's go. Hold on now. We can't all go sprinting across that thing, okay? We get spotted out there, we're gonna be trapped. Going around that lake will take too long. Right, but we've got no idea who's out there. Okay, I'm gonna sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group over. You think splitting up the group is a good idea? It's one person. Well, I never said it was a good idea, but it's better than risking everyone at once. What's your plan? Clem and I can scoot across low and slow, make sure nobody's waiting for us on the other side. We'll have a tough time covering you from back here. Well, we'll just turn back if it gets hairy. Or we'll die. Clementine should stay here. She's... She's what? She's just a little girl, Luke. She's a valuable little girl. I mean, hell, if she can sew up her own arm, she's fit to cross a bridge. He's got a point. I can do it. See? No problem. It's gonna be fine. Okay, we'll signal you guys in ten minutes. Just watch for a light at the far side. I can go too. You stay with the group. I'm fine. No, Luke. you're a liability. I don't like this. Yeah, well, when's the last time you liked anything, Carlos? Oh, snap. If something happens, I'll cover you. Come on. Hey, uh, sorry about that. I just could really use your eyes, and right now I don't trust Nick to tie his own shoes. They're just still on edge after the Carver thing. It's been five days. Why would Carver still be following us? What's the most important thing in this world? <coughs> what does everyone want? Even the gangs. You know, what do you think they're all after? Safety? Close. Family. Listen, what's the one thing a guy would walk hundreds of miles to get back? Family. It's a tough world out there without people you can trust. Anyways, you, you can ask Rebecca, okay? I'm, I'm not gonna get in the middle of it. We've all made mistakes. Rebecca is carrying, what's his name's? Carver's. Rebecca is carrying Carver's child. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm thinking. Done things that we regret. It's not my place to talk about someone else's past, you know? I know what that's like. Yeah. Ugh. Hmm. Can't shoot them. Too much noise. There are only two. Let's take them. I like your style. Unless we die. I'll take the big one. You get shorty. Wish we could use guns. 
We should be okay. I think. Got it. I'll take the small one. This isn't going to turn out Let's well, is it. it? I make choices and I just regret them two seconds afterwards. I know. I've done this before, remember? In a shed. It got quiet all of a sudden. Nice work, kid. <laughs> Ow. S okay. So, so far they're like a brother-sister kind of thing. What if Clementine was like five years older? <laughs> this sounds super creepy, Tori. <laughs> Maybe ten years older. I don't know how old this guy is, actually. Oh no, now they're behind us. Oh, unfortunate. about that. I thought we got it. I thought we were good. I, I literally can't see where my cursor is. It's not my fault, I'm blind. All right, let's try to find our fucking cursor this time. There's just so much texture on the goddamn zombies. I don't know what I'm... Okay, all right. Actually worked out better than expected. They all gone. Thanks, Clem. Let's keep going. You see him? Yeah. Just play it cool. And you do the talking. Why me? Why me? I don't want to get in a fight. You really think he chewed a little bit? I mean... Just don't make any sudden moves. And don't piss him off. And don't tell him anything. What should I say? I don't know. Ask him for directions. Well, who are you? 
Well, who's asking? I am. I'm Clementine, and this is Luke. Clementine and Luke. You don't look like assholes. <laughs> Are you assholes? Yeah. No offense or anything, but you know how it is out here. You run into a lot of assholes. I'm not an asshole. Oh, are you calling me an asshole? <laughs> <laughs> you folks headed north like everyone else? Everyone else? I see at least one group a day move through here. You all look the same. It's like a great migration of the dazed and confused. Have you seen someone named Krista? Krista? Maybe. Really? No, nah, I mean, a lot of people come through here. I don't know. I gotta say, you two look like shit. If you need food, I've got some canned stuff in that station back there. Too generous. Well, I don't trust that's, you. Well, uh, awful nice of you. What's the catch? No catch. I've got plenty. Well, all right then. Thank you. Hey, no problem. Nice running into friendly faces out here. Like I said, I've got food and supplies back in the station. And if you... One. What the fuck, man? What the hell is he doing? Kill. No, 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 no. He's, he's with us. Dick! Don't shoot. No! Don't shoot! Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, someone needs to kill Nick. He's being a stupid sack of shit. Did I hit him? Where is he? I told you not to shoot. What? Who was that guy? He was going to help us. How do you know? Damn it, Nick. I told you not to shoot. How was I supposed to hear you? You gave me a clear shot. That shot rang out for miles. We gotta get off this bridge. Let's go. Someone kill him. I would not miss him now. I like I thought he was okay. He's just dumb. He's like such a fucking idiot. Why would you shoot someone unless you knew they were an actual fucking threat? God damn it, Nick. Fuck him. Who the fuck was that back then? I don't know. Looked like he had a gun on him. That asshole drew on me. He was about to shoot. Oh, was he? I'm telling you, man, he drew first. But that's not what it looked like to me. Shut up, Nick. What did you see, Clem? Is that guy gonna shoot? Fuck you, Luke. You've been on my case the whole week. And Maybe he was gonna shoot. Is, oh. Is it gonna do anything? I don't know. I know what I saw. Either way, you could have hit one of us. Yeah, but I didn't. Look, mm. I, I, I now I'm doubting. Close to you, Nick, but you can't don't fucking talk about him. You think he was with Carver? I don't know. I. No, I don't think so. But he fell off. He fell off the damn bridge. We have to keep moving. I can't. I need a minute. Fine. Look, can I talk to you alone? Maybe Nick did see something I didn't see. Hey, oh, Clem, no. you got anything to eat? Rex is dying here. Alvin, I told you I'm fine. Sorry, I'm out. Wish we still had those juice boxes. Yeah, me too. That man said he had food in the station. Mind checking it out? Maybe we could spend the night here. A little small for us, though. You could use a little downsizing. You're one to talk. Sure. They seem nice. Or, he seems Thanks, nice. Cliff. Alvin, so like, I don't know. I don't want to give him too much attitude. Maybe I should apologize. Maybe he really did see something. Or he's just a but I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't have been so mean. Oh, I'm doubting everything! <laughs> Sounds weird when I say it out loud, huh? Luke always used to push me. I never wanted to go into business with him. I remember when he sold me on his big plan. Some fucking plan. Case of beer in, he just said, Nick, we're burning daylight. That was that. 
After six months, we were flat broke. I didn't care. We were having fun. I wish I was like him. I wish I could just keep moving all the time. Oh, but you care too just much. Not. Sweetie, like I'm sorry. I've been so mean to you. <sighs> I'm sure they're talking about me right now. Luke, he's becoming a danger to the group. Who was that guy? I swear. It looked like he was holding you guys up. I figured he was with Carver. He seemed nice. Damn. If Alvin is in front of me, he takes that shot. What a fucking mess. Maybe I am losing it. I don't know anymore. Now I'm doubting you God, again, sir. Right. What time is it anyway? Time for you to get a watch! Oh! Damn. You don't even have a watch, do you, son? I left my watch back at the cabin. <laughs> gave it to me. That's all I had left of him. You He'll know always be in your heart. I'm gonna go talk to them. Okay, okay. There's probably people laying here, honestly. Empty cans. The man said he had lots of food. There's gotta be something left. Perhaps not. I'm not sure I trusted that man, but I'm also kind of pissed at Nick right now. I don't see a key around here. Wait, his name's that Nick, man right? Probably had it. Maybe his name is Nick. I'm so bad with names. We could use a weapon. Feels pretty good. I guess he slept here. It's dead. Is that it? That's all that was in here? Are you kidding me right now? The key has got to be around here somewhere, right? Maybe I missed something. I mean, I wouldn't put it past myself to miss something. Maybe we can go around here? Unlikely. Yeah, why can't we take the axe? Rebecca, are you okay? I'm alright. I just need a little rest. And some food. Alvin. Okay, well clearly I just didn't explore well enough. I missed something, didn't I? Alright, let me go back in here. See what I fucking missed. Starting to get a sinus headache. <laughs> I don't want one. I didn't even take the preemptive ibuprofen. I'm not ready for the headache. Oh, I'm a dumb bitch. <laughs> okay. Thought we had a bed. Look at this dump. Guess he did have food. Man, fuck Nick. Nick's lost a lot of his people, that's for sure. But that doesn't give him any excuse to start shooting up strangers. He was trying to help us. Yeah, and someone died. I ain't no judge, but that's straight up murder in my book. I mean, you ever know anyone to do a thing like that? <laughs> Actually, yeah. What happened? A woman in our group. Her dad died, and then she just shot this other woman. Damn. What'd you do? My friend forgave her. Huh. And then she stole our car and left us. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's not funny. <clears throat> That's funny. She looks just like you. 
Sure. Hey, Clem, there's not a lot of food here, and Rebecca, well, she's eating for two. You think we can keep this just between us? I hate to even say it, you know, but... And I'd never go against the group, but I've got to put Beck and the baby first. You understand, right? The whole group should decide. I know you're right. It's just so hard right now. It's a shame. Nick was a good guy. He's still a good guy. He's just losing it. God knows we're not perfect. Hell, I'm glad you're with us, Clementine. Yeah, because you guys can't look for your own damn food. I have to do it myself. The hell is that? But, uh, why now? Walkers. I mean, if we hurry, this won't be a big deal. Yeah, we saw it. All right, we're heading up. Yeah, like, they're all running. I am kind of concerned about Rebecca, though. That's a lot of exercise for a pregnant woman. That, I don't know how far along she is, but they're kind of running. Someone Could someone try to carry her at least for a little while? Well, what are we waiting for? We have to be careful. Careful? We've been on the road for five days. My back is done being careful. They could just take turns carrying her. I know she's probably really There's heavy no right now, but... Off. Even if it's just for a few minutes. Nail down tight. I'll check around front. I'll go with you. Someone boost Clementine up so that she can, like, puncture a window. Well, it'd be good to know if anybody's actually back there. Could probably get a better view from up top. You'd have an easier time getting up there, you... Feel like Not over. particularly, no. It'd be just like climbing a treehouse. <sighs> yeah, just a, a really tall treehouse. Why y'all making me do everything? Well, there you go. I hated it. <laughs> oh. What's his name, Luke? That's his name. If Luke dies, I'll be upset. I think he's kind of cute. And more importantly, he's kind. He's also kind of cute. Just take it slow, <coughs> and I'll catch up. <coughs> okay, Kate, did you need to add the last part to the sentence? You got a good grip? Yeah. When I was a kid, we used to jump rooftops downtown. Now Stop talking fun. and make sure I don't that fall. stupid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was. The trick was not to look down, though. <laughs> whoa, 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 you're fine. You're fine. Just look if I'm looking at you, I can't look at where I'm going, bitch. Slow down. For a second, okay? Got your grip? Keep your voice down. But you just yelled at me. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> She's so fucking cool. I love this girl. Oh, wow. It's high. Can we leave? Hi, Mr. Bird. How are you today? Are you going to try to kill me, too? Made it. See anything? I can see the bridge. All right, what am I missing? I'm fucking missing something. It's really dark. It kind of looks like that's all there is. I'm probably missing it right now as you speak, and y'all are like, "Oh my God, Tori, just like a little more to the right." Oh my god, what are you doing? Why can't you fucking see it? That's probably what y'all are thinking right now. Wait, I see something. Oh, what very is unfortunate. Wait, wait, there's another. Luke. Luke. So we're gonna fall. Luke's not gonna be there to catch us. It's just gonna go great. Uh huh. This is just. This is gonna be great. Um. Okay, I was like, I can't see. I didn't know if I could move. Yet or not. Move down. She got stuck for a moment there. Why is she sneaking? They're all the way over there. Listen, everyone, just stay calm. Who are you? Are you trying oh, wait. to excuse There's me? People honey, but do I look like a fucking thief? <laughs> everyone calm <laughs> down. Thief. Hey man, you calm the fuck down. Sarah, get behind just me. Just tell us who you are. We ain't here to rob nobody. Put the gun down, fuck man. Fuck that. Whoa, whoa. Honestly. Whoa. I know I swear a lot, but like if I was in this situation, I would refrain from swearing and I would 
stop using my aggressive voice, I guess. Like, okay, okay, when I'm talking to my friends or people that I know, I think that I, I it's not that I have a deeper voice, it's just like my normal voice, I guess. But if I'm really, really excited, or if I'm around someone, like, that I'm more careful, like, that I'm not comfortable with, not close with, or whatever, like, my voice tends to go up, like, four octaves. And if I was in this situation, I'd have the, oh my goodness, I'm so sorry, I don't mean to, like, disrupt you right now, and I'd use that voice, but no, these people are just like, do you think I'm a fucking thief? I'm like, that's not gonna help the situation! Please, just do what he says! Is that- ah! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Wait, you know this guy? Oh my god. so happy in my entire life. He looks different. His beard's definitely a little longer and a little more gray. <laughs> Guys! I knew he wasn't dead. I fucking knew it. Although, like, I definitely thought he was a little bit dead. But at the same time, like, I was in disbelief. I could not believe he was dead. He's fucking alive. My fucking heart. Oh. My mascara is probably running. Hold up. Uh, we're good. Is that Tchaikovsky playing in the fucking background? Jenny and Sarita have been staying with us for several weeks. Used to be a ski lodge, obviously, so we have plenty of food. Why is Waltz and, uh, the Flowers not, playing in the background? We some power from that wind turbine out front. We tend to keep most of the lights off at night to avoid drawing attention. But after we found this stuff in storage, we couldn't resist making an exception. What's funny? Oh, nothing, Walt. Walter here's one smart some bitch. Makes a mean can of beans, too. Well, why don't you two catch up while I get some dinner started? Please, make yourselves at home. You can leave your things over there. The hell we will. Yeah, I'm holding on to my rifle. Thanks. You're our guest here. There's no deal. Tell him to put his gun down, then. Kenny? Will you vouch for these people, Clem? If you tell me they're good, then I'm good. Us. You were the one waving a gun around, man. We're cool, okay? Hey, hey, we're cool. We're cool. They're cool. Do, 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 do. Dad, look, a Christmas tree. Not now, Sarah. Isn't it great? We found it all in storage. It's amazing. But now we just dragged this group into our fucking mess of what's his name trying to find us? Carver. But wait, now none of us will have if our you weapons all follow on us. Me, I'll show you where you can sleep. If they kill Kenny off again, I swear to God, I will not be playing this anymore. Kenny is my child. If he's gone, I'm gone. They better not kill him. If they do, I'm done. Like, I will not play this again. I'm gonna start crying again. <laughs> Still wearing this dirty old thing, huh? You know, I half expected to see Lee walk up next oh. to you. You guys were like two peas in a pod. Oh shit, I didn't mean to... It's just hard not to think about it, you know? I want to know how you survived the situation though, Kenny. <coughs> <coughs> he saved me. I knew it. I knew he would. That guy had a fire in him, sure as shit. 
He was a hell of a guy. When my son, well, he took care of him. Oh. I'll never forget that. <laughs> I feel like fucking shit. So, where'd you end up? I was with Krista and Omid. Then some bitch killed Omid. Omid. Well, fuck that bitch. Krista and I were together for a while. These guys caught us. She's gone. Sounds like it ain't been easy for you. I'm sorry, darling. I wish I could have found you sooner. Ooh. But everything's gonna be fine now. Where have you been? Where have you been? Oh, hell. All over after Savannah. How'd you get out of How that situation? Yes! Of yes! That's the real question! Krista got in a hell of a mess. I gave her a hand and then it got messier. For a minute there, it wasn't looking too good for old Kenny. Long story short, I got lucky. Real lucky. Spent a long time alone after that. It, uh... I've missed him so much. <laughs> and then I met Sarita. Thank God. Gosh, it's great to have you back. You two catching up? Blam he found love again! <laughs> I'm gonna cry. I'm so happy. I think I think that's his new like partner. Oh! This is my girl, Sarita. Isn't she beautiful. She's nice gorgeous. to meet you, Clementine. Hey, Walt. Where's Matthew? He's still out there rooting around. Of course he is. Well, I'll start dinner. Carlos, right? Mind if I steal your daughter for a secret mission? Stay in sight, sweetie. Can we do anything to help? Could use a hand outside. We got a lot of supplies to bring in before that storm hits. Sure. But wait, there's still those people out there looking Glenn, for why us. Why don't you help Walt with dinner? I should tell Kenny about the people with the flashlights who are looking for us. I guess not. <laughs> Feels like lying, but hey, Clementine. okay. Settling in well enough? Yeah, thanks. Excellent. Want to help me prepare a little dinner? What is it? So how do you know Kenny? Do I trust he you? He and Sarita have been a huge help. Matthew and I barely knew what to do around here the first week. But Kenny, well, he never slows down. We're old friends. I met him after it happened. When he was with Lee? Yeah, he only told us a little. Connecting with people is so important. I don't know what I'd do without Matthew. Are those beans? Gosh, you remind me of my students. I can't imagine what it's like growing up in the middle of all this. Much like getting old in all of this. It fucking sucks. <sighs> it hasn't been easy. I can imagine. It's hard enough as an mm -hmm. adult. Mm. Almost done. Would you do me the honor of tasting the first course, madam? It looks like worms. What is this? Le Walter Surprise. Uh, an autumnal legume salad with a peach roux. Do I trust that? It's peaches and beans. <laughs> That's all we got. Huh. <coughs> Striking resemblance. Why does everyone keep saying that? Just because of the pigtails. Anyway, I'll take it from here. Wait, I thought you needed help. All you needed... What? I thought I was supposed to help you. Whatever, bitch. Do it yourself. I don't give a fuck. Cousin Jared's concert, October 13th, 1998. A little bit younger than I am. It reminds me of school. Cafeteria. I feel like we can't go this way at all, but I'm gonna do it anyway. It feels so weird to be playing this episode so close to Christmas time, honestly. I mean, it, it's not that close to Christmas time, but I feel like it's still Christmas for some reason. 
are we still not going to tell anybody about the people they with the flashlights who are after us with Carver? Because that's my main concern right now. It's really hard for me to like feel happy about decorating a Christmas tree. I like this song. I don't care. <laughs> you in excelsis. Clem, we could use some help. Here, Sarah, you take this and string them up over there. You knew Kenny before. It must be incredible to see. It him truly again. is. It's a when fucking miracle. Him, well, he's so different now. But you must be so glad. So, how do you meet Kenny? I found him holed up in an old restaurant, if you can believe it. Hold up. You should have seen his beard then. Perfect. Now we just need the topper. We always had an angel on top of our tree. My family didn't celebrate Christmas. But I still love the decorations. That would be such a cute tree topper. It's a fucking duck. I love ducks. What I think they're so cute. Guy. I think my mascara is still running. God damn it, Kenny. Making my makeup look horrible. I want to use the duck as the topper. I think that would be adorable. I really want to use that. That'd be so cute. Fine, let's go find an appropriate one. I think I have like a hair on my cheek. It's bothering the shit out of me. <clears throat> it's crazy. Why would they follow us this far? We can't be sure. There it is. It's been a week, man. We gotta be out of the woods. We can't be sure. They might be tracking they us. They probably Tracking. are tracking us. What do you think they are? Ninja? Yes, they are. They know things. Clem, Luke said you saw some people in the valley. People? Way down there. How? She's got binoculars, genius. Yeah, yeah. What did you see, Clementine? I saw lights. Which way did they go? Back into the woods. We cannot take any chances. We leave at dawn. But we're safe here for tonight. Right? Unlikely. Clementine, you talked to that man Walter, right? What did he say? You didn't tell him anything about us, did you? We have to be careful. They could be hiding something. We mostly talked about Kenny. Kenny is the loud man with the beard? Yeah, that's him. Look, I don't care what that man said. We're staying here tonight. Just talk to the rest of them. They trust you. See what you can find out. But I trust them more than I trust you guys! Honey, I don't feel so good. Oh, is your right, water gonna break? I just need something to drink. You got it. I'll be right back. I wanna use the star. I think they're prettier than angels. Mm-hmm. nice, I guess. Oh my god. Beautiful. Uh, I used to love this time of Sarah, year. Sarah, so annoying. You know, now that your friends are here, this place is starting to feel like a real home. Matthew and Walter are amazing people. Honestly, it's dangerous to be this kind. Oh, they I should have talked to the bitch upstairs first. Wait until you meet Matthew. He's a real character. The first time he met me, he called me Rita. So I call him Maddie now. 
It's kind of our little war. What does Matthew look like? Oh, he's a handsome man. A little shorter than Walter. He should be back soon. Uh, and so we die. I wanted to ask you, does Kenny seem different to you? I didn't know him before. And, well, I'm curious. He seems happier. He has good days and bad days like everyone else. But lately I get the feeling he's struggling. He does seem different than I remember. In what way? He's happier. I'm not sure. Oh my god, fuck that. Well, you three are <coughs> busy. Kenny, isn't it great? I thought she was going to give me an option to say that he's been happy. I think I can manage, Ken. I said I got it. Oh, wait. Oh, fuck. Always has to play the gentleman. But I'll tell you, when I met him, he couldn't lift a fly. Is he weak and starving? Why don't you go see if your friends are ready for dinner, Clementine? Let me go back upstairs and talk to the pregnant bitch. She's growing on me. She's still a hoe. Is there anything over here? Probably not, because they didn't give me that point of view. Are you okay? Just got a little dizzy. I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? I mean, how can anyone now? Everything's so fucked up. I think it's possible. How do you know? Oh my god. Well, I'm still here. I know it's going to be hard, but at the same time, I already feel a little less lonely because I know that no matter what happens, I'll get to meet someone new. She's kicking. You want to listen? Sure. That food smells good, huh? It's okay. Ugh, children. Can I? Even unborn ones. Ugh. She's going <coughs> to run it. Which means you're gonna die. It's not his. I figured. Whose is it then? Maybe Carver raped her. If Alvin finds out, he'll kill me. I don't know what to do. I would tell him the truth. I can't believe I'm asking a little girl for advice. But I guess nothing's weird anymore. He won't kill you. There's my man. You all right, baby? Oh. I'm fine, you big dope. Just need to get some food in you. Thanks for staying with her, Clem. Well, I mean, she didn't get raped. She just Dinner cheated. Is served. Come on, let's eat. Hmm. I think it could be Carver's. Because he was kind of specifically looking for her. You okay, man? Yeah, just... I wish I hadn't pulled that trigger. Just try to forget about it. Right here, Clem. Oh no, I don't like this! Am I gonna have to decide? I don't wanna! I like them both! But Kenny's my boy. I have to choose Kenny. Now they're not gonna trust me as much. Here you go, Clem. Oh, he's hurt! Ah! So, God damn it! We were just talking. What's the deal <clears throat> with the kid? What's his name? Luke? He in charge? You trust him? I do him? trust him. Kenny, please. Sarita, we don't know these folks. They seem nice. Yeah, well, gators seem nice too till they bite your damn arm <laughs> off. I like him. He's a good guy. Would you trust him with your life? Oh, no. I think so. Yeah, yeah. I would, yeah. That guy, Big Al, he said they were on the run. Some people are after them. Well, you don't have to worry about that no more. They'll go tomorrow and you can stay Oh, here. no. Absolutely. Honey, you stay with us as long as you want. She's staying for good. <laughs> I don't know how to deal with this. I'd rather stay with Kenny, honestly. Okay, I need to decide definitively before I press resume game. I want... God damn it, I really don't know. I really don't know. Okay, I don't know.
that's what she wants. Of course she does. Right, Claire? Oh. I can't leave my friends. What? Of Kenny! Of course you can't. They can stay too. No. Honey. Hey there. Hey. Hope you like the food. Oh, it's... it's great. Thank you. Peaches and beans. Great for nutrition. Not too great on the way out, though, I tell you. <laughs> Is he drinking? So, it's Luke and Nick. Luke and Nick. You guys sure do look like a match. What's that supposed to mean? I'm just saying you look like good friends, that's all. Oh, no. So, what was your plan here? Hold out for the winter? Actually, we were thinking of moving on. Somewhere up north. You ever heard of a place called Wellington? That sounds real Wellington? familiar. The hell is that? A place. What kind of place? A good one, Einstein. I don't know much about it. It's supposed to be a big camp up near Michigan. Wait, is that where the 400 days people went? Was Wellington? Because it sounds so familiar. God, I don't remember shit. Michigan? You got a hearing problem, kid? Yeah, Ooh. Michigan. Think about it. Fresh he's water, drinking. lots of land, and cold ass winter, so the walkers get slow. I think Sounds he's like drinking. bullshit. Listen, Vanilla Ice, I don't know what your deal is, but you're more than welcome to take off in the morning. And that'd be just fine by me. What's the deal with these guys, Clam? Hey, fuck you, buddy. Oh. It's fine, Nick. We're not staying. She's staying. What? <laughs> Excuse me? You heard me. Luke, listen to him. I have been, but. Kenny's my friend. <gasps> Gentlemen, please. There's no need for this. Now look, we've all had a long day. Please eat. Pass me that can, duck. <gasps> duck? Who's duck? Kenny. He's still dealing with a lot of grief. Hey, Clementine, would you uh, lend me a hand outside for a moment? Oh, he's breaking my fucking heart. <laughs> I hate a duck with a fiery passion, but seeing Kenny sad just breaks my heart. No tears today. No tears. No more tears. No more tears today. <coughs> uh, I'm sorry about you know, I used to be a teacher. I remember what it's like to be caught in the middle of two clicks. I suspect they'll find common ground soon. I don't think they will. It may take a little time, but that's just how these things work. Everything will be fine. Doubtful. Listen, relationships are like any machine. You don't throw them out when they break down. You get your hands dirty and you grease the wheels. What do you say? Will you help me work on them? The two of us must unify our factions for the common good. You know, like Churchill and Roosevelt. I don't know how to the deal world with this. Is over, but I'll tell you a secret. It's not. People are more political now than they ever You are were frighteningly before. optimistic, In the end, sir. We can't change them. All we can do is continue to learn from each other, to empathize, and use our heads. All war is a symptom of man's failure of thinking ahead. Steinbeck. Have you read him? Well, we have plenty of time to catch you up on your reading. My partner Matthew is Steinbeck. S Grapes of Wrath? East of Eden? I'm not sure. I want to know though. Give me a second. I used to like reading books. Now I don't, but I used to. Grapes of Wrath, East of Eden. I knew it! <laughs> I fucking knew it. It's amassing quite the literature collection. I think you'll like it. Matthew's your partner. In any case, the point is, as long as we have our wits about us, we can always make a good choice. Right? Mm. Right. <coughs> What's the matter, Clementine? Is there something you want to tell no, me? No, not really. You can talk to me, Clementine. 
There's almost nothing you could tell me that would surprise me. I can promise you. I'm worried about your friend. I think that... Don't worry. Matthew will be back soon. And everything will be fine. But I think... Hey, kids. What are you two talking about? Oh, politics. What the hell? Well, being from Florida, I would imagine you know all about politics, Kenny. Man, I know one advantage of living in the apocalypse is not dealing with that shit. I was just gonna check the windows round back before this storm hits. Give us a hand? Sure. Miss? It's you. You were gonna go with what's her name to Please, Wellington. Do you have any food? Are you okay? I saw the house and I have a family. We're starving. We live down there. Uh, of course. Why don't you come in, Miss... Bonnie. Walt, I don't know. You just gonna let her in like that? It's fine, Ken. We don't know this girl. Then we'll have to get to know. Her. Right, Clem? I Don't! Stop! These decisions are too difficult! Bonnie was okay, I guess. But this is just... It's too many crossovers. It's just There's just too much going on. There's too many characters that I like. Too many stories I want to see unravel. I don't know what to do about this Bonnie bitch. I mean, she was okay in 400 days, I guess. She did kill someone prematurely. She was liking a married guy. And then she was going to go to, I believe, Wellington with that one woman who was recruiting. A little odd, if you ask me. But she was recruiting nonetheless. What does she mean, I have a family? Because if I recall correctly, you don't have a family. Maybe you just have your traveling companions, but those aren't necessarily your family. So that leads me to believe that she's fibbing a little. And if she's not completely honest, I'm not sure I should trust her in this particular scenario. You feel? Walt, how much damage can this poor woman do? And she's a former Check drug addict, I think. Yeah. Thank you. Really? That storm will be on us soon, and I gotta get back to my family. I'll bring something out to you. It'll literally take five seconds to check you. Like, now I really don't trust her. Mm. You don't have to do that. No, Wait. no, it's fine. What about your people? We've got plenty. Oh, well, don't tell her that. Right back. Say we have enough for one more person. I have a little girl like you. Do you? I really don't remember that shit. How old are you, sweetie? <laughs> I... I don't know. Do you have a kid? Really? I swear to God, you didn't have a kid. Wait, why are you giving them so much food? That's so much! Well, too generous. Too much. Yeah, it is. Don't Take some it. of it back. I don't know how to thank you. Just help someone else down the line. Thank you so much. Bonnie, I did like you, but I, I'm not sure I'm trusting you right now. She didn't have a kid, did she? I gotta talk for a second. I swear to God, Bonnie didn't have a child. So I'm not sure. Did she? I don't remember. I'm like thinking back to 400 days, which wasn't even all that long ago. And I swear to God, she didn't have no child. Mm. Clementine, don't freak out. What are you doing? Listen, yeah, I gotta tell you something. Oh no. That guy on the bridge was Walter's friend. F no! Oh fuck! Fuck! No! No! So I asked Sarita about my friend. Now they're all worried he's not back yet. Where's Nick? I don't know. Fuck. Fuck. I don't think Walter knows yet. So we have to keep this quiet. I mean, who knows what the hell he'd do if he found out. Fuck, 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 fuck. We should tell him. He's gonna ask who did it, and you're gonna tell him. It's the right thing to do. It is the right thing to do. It's right to get Nick killed because that's what's gonna I happen. I mean, Nick's kind of been dumb. Now, do you, uh, 
You still have that and knife? And overly aggressive. Because if it was Matthews and Walter sees it, he's gonna put two and two together. It's with the other weapons. Okay, well, go get rid of it. And I'll find Walter and run interference. Oh, and, uh, keep an eye out for Nick. I'm right here. What's up? Oh, uh, there's nothing, man. I just wanted to check and see if you're okay. We have to tell you something. Hey, if there's something going on, I want to know. You did an no, oopsie. Go back to bed, Nick. I'm serious. You guys can talk to me. Are I you going to freak out, though? You don't trust me now? Look, Clem, just go do that thing, all right? I Come don't on, know. Nick, let's I, go find a beer or something. Mm, I couldn't make a choice. I just, I couldn't. Uh, I should have shown him the photo. It's gone. Oh no. <sighs> I'm not making great decisions. The decisions have been very poor. Oh, he knows. He knows. He fucking knows. It's it, it's Walter and Matthew. Are you okay? I always like this knife. Fuck. Gave it to Matthew when all this started. <sighs> crap, crap. I know he's dead. Who did it? Was it that, that kid? What's his name? Uh, Nick? Fuck. Heard him talking earlier or something about shooting a man. I could see it. Fuck. I could see it on his face. Fuck. I wasn't sure then. But now. Drama! I don't know! <laughs> I wonder if he's going to stay Jesus. optimistic. I, uh, I don't feel... He doesn't seem the type to get revenge, but I don't know. Nick shot him. Fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Is, uh, is Nick a good man? Or is he just like everyone else? He is. He's a good guy. He is a good guy. He's just really fucking dumb. He was always going out alone. I told him something like this would happen, but he wouldn't listen. No, Matt always knew best. What's going on? What do you think, yeah. dumbass? Tell him what? What happened on the bridge? <sighs> Fuck, I should have shown him the photo. Oh, God, I'm so stupid. Just tell me, son. Tell me what happened. From a distance, it looked like anyone. I, I, I thought I thought he was gonna shoot my friends, and I. Oh no! I shot Matthew. But it, 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 it happened real fast. I didn't I didn't know if I hit him, but I did, and I didn't mean to. Do you know what you've done to me? Do you have any idea? I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Walter. Like spin the off. Storm's got it spinning out of control. That sound's gonna draw walkers. We gotta shut it down now. Nick, help me. Carry the guns. Guns? That thing's a damn dinner bell. Is someone gonna get decapitated by the spinny thingy magic? Transformer must have gone. Gotta check it. I could 
use a hand. I'll go with you. I'm going to. No! It's too dangerous. The rest of you, get this thing shut down. If you kill Kenny in front of me, I'm fucking done. Just this? shoot it and create sparks and stop it from Great. moving. I can do it. Wha wha stop volunteering yourself for we'll things! Nick, I can't place do place. this shit. Clem, why do you do this to me? You know I lack common sense sometimes. Especially if it's obvious. Oh, there's a key. Oh. Oh, that's my only fucking option? Huh? Okay. Is it gonna explode? No one else could have figured that shit out. Y'all fucking fail. Something ain't right. Yeah. Time to leave. Generic ass looking zombies. They all look the same. We don't have much ammunition. Then let's run. Back. Jesus Christ, y'all y'all just sitting there. They're behind us. <clears throat> Fucker, Jesus. What, you're making me take care of all of these guys? Rude, first of all. run why are you just sitting there I guess she's just scared I mean technically we can outrun them Fuck. Um, there's a gun under there wait wait um get the gun or nah they literally walk and you run Oh, that's why he kept it there. Fuck, 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 fuck. Ouch, that would hurt. I mean, I could use that, but like, let's try this again. Oh, fuck, we're gonna die! Wait, keep it! Don't leave it! Oh, he's not gonna kill Nick. He's gonna kill the zombie. We're literally okay. See? Okay. See, he's like a nice guy. Oh. <laughs> there is so much drama in this fucking episode. when the episodes, when the Walking Dead episodes were just a lot more slow paced and now it's just like one thing happening after another like oh my god season two is doing well in my book right now. Are you okay? <clears throat> we gotta get ready to leave. What the hell? Who knew? It's Carver. Bonnie, you little bitch. Howdy, folks. God damn it. Where's Rebecca? Carver. Oh, maybe we shouldn't it's have nice done that. You too. Oh. 
<sighs> Sarah. What is Sarah doing this time? Oh, being a dumb hoe. Okay. Wow. Inside. <sighs> Bonnie. Bonnie. It's you. Oh, she feels a little bit bad. There was a glimmer of doubt there. She's so malleable. I don't think I said that right either. Malleable. Malleable? I've only ever read that word. I don't think I've ever said it. Look at this place. Fucking place, Bonnie. Power and everything. A lot of windows. Though. It's fucking huge. Bill's gonna hate it. Now the rest of them could be anywhere. Man, how the fuck are we gonna cover these guys and look for them too? Johnny, cover that window. Hmm, Bonnie, dumb cunt. Fuck that hoe. Actually, I don't really know the story there with why Carver's such a bad guy. I, I guess I never really asked that question, did I? Are you gonna make an example out of us? Cause please no. I actually like this guy. Listen, I'm only gonna ask you once. Where's Rebecca? Sarah, look at me. It's gonna be okay. Oh. Oh. Rebecca! Oh. Rebecca! Our baby deserves to be raised <laughs> in a place of safety. <laughs> I know you're out there. Oh, oh the then. fucking drama! This is real simple. You want this over quick. Don't play nice. And show your face. <laughs> He'll kill him. No, Alvin. We gotta go down there. I can't do that. Beck, the baby. You need a doctor. No. Where's Logan Kenny? How the hell am I supposed to know? They're still outside. They can help us. We have to help Carlos. Only way to help him is to do what the man says. What about Logan Kenny? Look at those guns. If we start shooting, people are gonna die on both sides. Wait, where are Luke and Kenny right now? I forgot. Clint can sneak out. Find Luke. What the hell is she gonna do? And you heard him. Carver knows she's with us. Just stop! Don't hurt my dad, please! We're going down there. And kill you. Fuck you. Shoot him! Somebody just shoot him! <laughs> Go get him. He'll kill him, Beck. He'll do it anyway. You don't know that. Say goodbye, Carlos. Don't look, sweetie. Don't look. Dad! We have to give up. He'll kill him. We have to give up. <sighs> Nobody? Not that disappointing. Uh, I, I gotta trust that Kenny can do something, like... I'm not... Carver's methods aren't that great, though. I mean, I don't know. I don't know whose side I'm on, really. Are they gonna kill- Oh, fuck. Are they really gonna kill Gar- Oh, are they gonna kill Carlos? Why am I looking through this door? I- I don't understand why. Alright, time to hurry up. <laughs> Very scary! Seriously, where's Kenny and Luke, though? My two favorite people. Clamp!
not all they came down anyway. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Looks like they got everyone. Who are these guys? Can we take them? I'm not sure. the best decision. Wait, don't kill him. No! No! Please no! Please no! Please no! This poor guy suffered so much already! You have your girl! Shouldn't you be happy right now? No. Walt! <laughs> That's for our man! Now, I didn't want to do this! But you ain't leaving me much choice. So here's what's gonna happen! I'm gonna march another one of your friends out here, and I'm gonna put a bullet in the back of their head. Or you can give up now. Your choice. Motherfucker. Kenny may not have been the best decision ever. Kenny, over there! Too much. We're coming out. Let's go. Bonnie. Fucking bitch. Where's Luke? What's your beef with Luke? Finally cut and run, huh? Why am I not surprised? I warned you. I warned you not to follow him. Look where he's led you. But you're safe now. We're going home. As a family. You're a little slimy. Alright, round him up. We're heading back to camp. Oh, darn it. I do believe I've made an incorrect decision. What a fucking surprise. Fantastic. <laughs> hmm. Interesante. Oh, my goodness, this has been a lot. good guys that's oh, I'm real excited for episode three I'm having so much fun I hope you guys did too and until the next episode I hope you guys have a great day bye guys mm -hmm.